I can't believe I'm actually going to be able to sit ringside and call his fight with you, Mike. He does, and at 10 years older than Badahari, at 39 years old, you wonder what he's got left in the tank. He's certainly going to try and pull it all out tonight. And listen to this place shouting, Badahari! Wow. And now, making his entrance to the red corner in the red. Bada. Bad boy, Hardy. I fear for Liko if he will, if he pulls off a victory here and knocks Badahari out, you realize the reaction of this crowd. There is nothing like it in the world of fight sports than Badahari entering the ring. The death stare with his trainer, Mike Casania. The bad boy Badahari. 88 knockouts in 102 wins. One of the highest knockout ratios in the world. All the streets are on their feet. Even Diego Maradona is on his feet. This is crazy. Gentlemen, Golden Cage Promotions in association with the Dubai Sports Council present this, the semifinal match number two of the GSC Championship Tournament. Three three-minute rounds with KO rules. Referee in charge of the action at the bell, Stefano Valente. Introducing first, wearing black with red wearing black gloves. He weighed in officially 100 kilograms and comes to us by way of Croatia and Germany. In the ring, his fighting record consists of 69 victories, including 38 knockouts. He's the 2001 and 2006 K1 World Grand Prix champion, former Muay Thai world champion and two-time kickboxing heavyweight World Champion, Stefan Blitz Lake. And fighting out of the red corner, wearing black with white gloves, this super heavyweight comes to us from Morocco by way of the Netherlands, a disciple of kickboxing and Muay Thai, with 102 victories, 88 wins by knockout. He's the former K1 heavyweight champion, the Devil Prince of Morocco, Butter 
Bad Boy Hardy! Serious power. That took from it. But a hurry. Like I'm trying to get on the inside. He's going to go to Hurry's jaw. Yeah, he's hunting that chin. And back of the head. Drags him down. Hit him in the back of the head. Like I've heard. Ringside back of Peter Lewis in there. After he counting. Can Like I get up. A quarter of butters come in. And pandemonium. Referee's telling him to get the hell out of there. Like I'm wobbling here. Like oh. I it was a hard shot to the back of the head, right to the neck, skull region. Vicious. Liko loading up for one shot, just trying to get to that chin. Badahari has got a nasty look on his face. Badahari left for the game. A little round kick to the ribcage. Like I'm in all sorts of trouble. Right hand from Bada. Like I want to duke it out toe to toe. Bada with the right hand. Down goes Like a big couple. Unloading on Liko. The big couple. Can Liko make it? Second knockdown. That's good night, Ali. Bada Hurry can just step out like in the first round. Too big, too fast, too young, Michael. They are going absolutely crazy here. Hey, good sportsmanship in the corner, though. Bada Hurry walked across, gave him a hug. Good sportsmanship. What will happen in the final? A fresh Bada Hurry will take on a better Peter Graham. Yeah, not what Peter Graham was hoping for. You know he was hoping for a war here. Badahari unloading right to the back of the neck here. Wasn't on purpose, just threw the punch. Such a big, powerful guy, though. Here he comes. On the full extension of his punches there, you're just not going to be able to deal with that. I don't care who you are. The reach, the power, and this place went into meltdown. A sellout crowd in Dubai. They love Bada Hurry. They've traveled down from Europe. They've traveled up from Africa. And they're still chanting his name. Now going on to the main event. GFC final here tonight with a chance to win 1 million dirhams. 127, round number one, the Devil Prince of Monaco, Butter Bad Boy. Ha! 